Megan, Sweat Ethics newest athlete. And I'm Chad with Conquer Fit. Uh, we're here up at level two. Today, Chad is going to be showing us some proper form and technique so that we avoid hurting ourselves in the gym. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right. So just give me about two good squats here. All right, go ahead and rack for me. Okay, so two big things that I noticed almost immediately. So there's a landmark on the back of your neck, it's your C7, okay? The big thing we don't want is we don't want the bar there, okay? If the bar is here, A, it's painful, and B, this can cause a lot of issues. So where we want the bar is actually right here. There's actually, if you squeezed up your traps right here, you see that little spot right there? Yeah. It's actually a perfect place for the bar to sit okay. because there's two big muscles right there that you can sit on. Okay. The other thing is making sure you're center on the bar. Okay. So you were actually, about an inch off, so you were sideways. Okay. Now, when you descend, your first descent was good, but when you come up, always make sure you come all the way up. Okay. The biggest mistake people make in a squat is when they come up, they only come to here. Well, my hips are still engaged here. They're not up under me. Okay. And it ends up tightening up your psoas muscle, so it's a, it's a bad postural type thing. Again. So, other than that, your feet were in good position. Um, we are going to try to train you on the hip hinge today. Okay. You still have a hip flexion. We want a hip hinge. We want to get the hips out of the way and set down. It's not nice. Make the legs do the work. Okay. All right? So we're going to try it again. Okay. What I want you to do is make sure you're even first. So how I like to do it generally is I'll actually place myself here and then I'll kind of step, bring myself up, boom, and then come up to the bar. Okay. That way I know I'm right. If, if I can feel as yeah. soon as I lift off that I'm in the middle, I know I'm in a good position. Okay. All right, so let's do that again. Now turn it straight up, come straight back. Aha. Now, stand straight up. Now, when you come back, I want you to push your hips out of the way. So I want you to drag the hips back and sit down. Okay. Make sure your weight goes all the way down under your ankle. Now press back up. Good. I'm actually gonna jump around you here. Keep going. Aha, anyway. We don't wanna rely on the toes because then we kinda of come up into a T-Rex kind of situation. Okay. But you don't wanna rely on the heel either because what most people don't realize is the heel is actually behind you. So anatomically speaking, my heel is behind me. Yeah. So I want, I want you to focus on dropping down into your ankle. Okay. Okay? So push your hips back nice and hard. Drop right down, keep your knees behind your toes. Squeeze the core. Good. Now, with your eye line, I want you to look at our lovely cameraman. Okay. Okay? Boom. So I hope that was helpful. Thank you, Chad. Absolutely. Guys, again, uh, I'm up here at TBK with ConquerFit. Um, I have a deal going right now for 20% off all training programs. So if you're interested in that, please reach out to me. You can find me on Facebook. Um, you can also find me on Instagram or at my Trainerize profile online. So if you look up CockerFit, that'll come right up. Um, uh, CrotsChatM at gmail.com. That's my email. Shoot me an email. Let's get started today. Remember, sweat epic, sweat hard, work harder.